Today we're going to make one of my favourite soups. It's a chickpea, sweet potato and spinach soup. It's really, really, really delicious um, and it is absolutely packed with nutrients and you'll only need one saucepan to make it. So let's go. We've got some onions to start with. I'm going to fry up these onions and then we are going to chop up a big sweet potato. The sweet potatoes are a really nutritious form of carbohydrates, um, so really good for energy and um, they're actually quite low in uh, glycemic index, so it means that they're very sustaining energy as well, yeah. especially if you keep your skin on, which we're doing in this recipe. Oh yeah, um, never bother taking more skin off. No, <laughs> it's really good for fibre as well, um, so yeah, all round great for goodness and they're delicious as well. So we're going to cook those down. I'm going okay. to um, put a teaspoon of cumin seeds. I'm going to pop a cinnamon stick in as well. Okay, <laughs> cinnamon is great for anti-inflammatory as well. So this is quite a good meal um, to have on like a recovery day. So really nutritious, help your muscles get back to, to normal, ready for the next day of training. So yeah. Okay, I'm going to shove the sweet potatoes in. Um, yeah. I'm going to put the clove of garlic in. Just uh, grate the garlic in. You have to watch your nails a bit, actually. Um, we're going to put a knob of ginger in. So fresh ginger. This is wow, it's one. massive. I know, it's really, it's really <laughs> knobbly. If you use a spoon and you just scrape it like, like this, yeah. the skin comes off incredibly easy and you don't waste any of the ginger. Oh, perfect. Yeah. <laughs> How much do you need, about an inch worth or? Uh, about an inch worth, yeah. yeah. Two centimetres. Okay, cool. Smells good. Right, we're gonna pop the rest of the ingredients in now. Okay. So we've got a tin of chickpeas, uh, tomatoes. Okay. You can use fresh tomatoes if you want. Ooh, a pinch of cayenne pepper, English mustard powder, a spoonful of honey. Yeah. Mm. This is some honey I bought in France. It's really, really lovely. Just fry that off for a couple of minutes, really. Okay. Um, and then we're going to add the stock. So this stock, I've chosen a vegetable stock. You could use chicken stock if you want. But bring that to the boil. And we're going to cook that for about 20 minutes. Then we're going to blend it in the blender. So let's have a look. This has been cooking for 20 minutes or so. And the Sweet potatoes are all nice and tender, so it's ready to ready to blend. What I'm going to do though is take out the cinnamon stick. <laughs> Good idea. <laughs> That's not going to be very nice blended. So we're going to put the liquid in, and then just going to spoon in the, the solid bits. There we go. You might have to do this in two batches depending on how big your blender is. I often, quite often use a hand blender. Turn that on. There we are. Okay. The moment of truth. <laughs> <laughs> so all we need to do now is pour that back in the pan. That just that just looks like goodness, doesn't it? Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> and it's so easy and so quick and so cheap. It's a really cheap dish to make. So all I'm going to do now is add the spinach. Okay. Um, you need to do it kind of gradually. Just stir that until the spinach wilts in. Excellent. Um, and that is ready to serve. Excellent. So we'll get a couple of bowls. Here we are. Delicious. Yum. So there we have spinach, sweet potato and chickpea soup. Mm. That is really good, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs>